it is finally here. Arpa Glutton is coming in clutch. You can go and check him out on Twitch. The link will be in the description. He has got over 1.5 million tournament credits. And today we're doing chromatic cups only. So I want you to smash a like down below. Let's break. Can I say 5,000 likes for this video? That's insane. And with this new Nike update, they seem to have changed the interface, which is, I mean, I mean, if it ain't broke, don't fix it. But I guess it looks kind of cool. Maybe it means we get better luck because we have got a lot of rewards to open as well as that. I'm going to be opening the drop from the challenges, the Nike challenges, redeeming all of the rewards, doing a couple trade ups. So you do not want to miss any of this video. Once again, massive shout out to my guy, Arpit Glarton. Really nice dude. Go and check him out on Twitch and drop him a follow. And subscribe because we are so, so close to 930,000 subscribers. I can almost smell it. <laughs> and when we get there, one of you will be winning 10,000 credits. With that being said, let's get to it. So first of all, we might as well go to these challenges, view challenges. He said he left all of these so we could do them on the video. But saying that, you've kind of all seen these and I've done videos about them. So I'm just going to redeem them all for him now. It's very satisfying, I have to say. So we're just going to redeem, redeem. Obviously, my favorite of all of these is the New Zealand Nike Federation decal. Absolutely phenomenal. Claim that as well. And this is the big one. We're starting off with a golden egg. Come on for the boys. Open them up. Let's see what we get. It's going to be a rare, so nothing great. We do now have a few little very rare drop trade-ups to do. And then one exotic trade-up as well. So if we go to... We're going to keep the anodized, I believe. And then we're going to keep it within the drop series. So we're going to keep those two and trade up the rest uh, obviously not the black falcos let's see if we can get anything good here not likely to happen but you never know so let's go with this tsunami beam nothing great there we are also going to keep the scarab because we are a member of scarab gang so we're gonna go with you two now okay nothing great marauder brilliant car by the way magic missile and i think that's pretty much it i can't remember if they said i could trade up the anodized anodized pearl so i'm going to leave that there let's see what we get here uh, yeah, we can trade up these. Bang! Photon wheels. And now we have a trade up that we can do. So we're going to include all of the series wheels. Here we go. And then they said to trade up the pulses wheels uh, if we didn't have another series wheel from the golden egg. So here we go. This is a decent chance of a crate black market. And therefore, we could get some paint. Come on! Yes! Painted Atomizer. That is an absolute dub. Things you love to see. And now I'm just going to check the archive. There we go. Everything, I believe, is what we want to keep. I think I also need to keep the sparklet. And then once that's all archived, we can trade up anything else. All right, so I've sorted out the archive. These are all the items we're going to keep. And then I'm also, I've been instructed to keep any blade on inverted wheels, painted or not, that aren't duplicates. And the same with Sunsetter. Everything else we're going to trade up. Arpic Lantern's favorite thing from this accolade series is the Ampler Dude. So we're going for painted Ampler Dudes. And with that being said, there's no time for delay. Let's get into it. We're starting off with a proper wheel. Nothing great there. We can absolutely smash through these because we're getting paint. Painted only with a black sunsetter. That is an absolute massive dub. Proffer hatch. That's going to get traded up. Blade on inverted gray. We're going to be keeping that. Hopefully, we can also get the blade on inverted non-painted because they would like that as well. We got another gray. Back-to-back -back exotic grays. Not too bad. I'm looking forward to see what our first black market is going to be. My prediction is going to be Cobalt Ampler Dude. Ooh, titanium white blade on inverted. It's not entirely sure on how that really changes the wheel too much, but it's a good one to keep, especially knowing that we're going for these items here. So let's smash through it. Pink sunsetter. I want to get the titanium white. With this many, I want to get the titanium white. So let's keep going. Dishy wheels. I do not want to see any of those. Two titanium white blade on wheels. I might keep one of them back, even though it's not the inverted version. But look at this. We've still got over a million tournament credits to go. And there's another sunsetter for the collection. We're still yet to see a black market. I take it back. We got a pink star liner. Things you absolutely love to see. And I'm hoping I want I want to see some cool ampler dudes because there's no way I could ever get this many tournament credits on my own account because that would decent the crun setter <laughs> sounds a bit weird uh, because that would mean not doing any tournament openings for the whole season and even if i did that i wouldn't get 1.5 million tournament credits i don't grind the tournaments like arpic Larton does uh we've got orange blade on inverters but i think we're gonna need to do a nose cup now bang okay that was a little bit washed how about the lucky beard bosh yeah <laughs> The lucky beard. Titanium white sunsetter. Now let's get something else back to back. 
Okay, I shouldn't have. I should, you know, that you can have too much of a good thing. And apparently that was too much of a good thing. Now what I'm going to do, I'm going to do three no reaction chromatic cuts because these are absolutely jokes and they are some of my favorites to do. So here we go. No reaction cup. I'm going to say no reaction cup in between each one. So then I can make a clip if it's sick. Okay. No reaction cup. And no reaction cup. move on bro the luck is unreal the luck is absolutely unreal i could definitely make a clip out of that we got another crimson sunsetter another dishy wheel another blade on wheel a first ampler dude oh that would have been so sick if we got that okay now i'm gonna do i'm gonna do a no look i'm gonna do four no looks for you i've taken off the headband so i can't hear what rarity it is one bang one skip okay you didn't see the, the paint color on that one one i'll let you see this one you can freak out in the comments Bang. Okay, there we go. You can have a look. Right. Did we get... I mean, four chromatic cups. Surely we got something, right? Garage. Manage inventory. Oh, uh, okay. I mean, Grey Striker Blade on Invert is pretty cool, but no black markets. We've had one black market. What is going on, game? Come on. I think we get one in three cups. So not this one. Not this one. Oh, wait, it's the Cobalt Ampler, dude. It's the Cobalt. I said that, right? I said the Cobalt Ampler, dude. Come on. And I did say we'd get a black market in three crates. Oh, it's a crimson proper hatch. We got it. Oh, my goodness. We predicted the color of Ampler, dude, we were going to get. That's, I mean, that's less than 10% of doing that. And that's assuming we even got an Ampler, dude, which was obviously likely with this many chromatic cups. But say less. Thank you, game. I appreciate that. And of course, then we have so many trade-ups that we can do. We can trade up everything that isn't a Sunsetter or Blade on Inverted Wheel. And we can also trade up duplicates of that because I know we've got a few duplicates of those things. So there's going to be plenty more to get. We're going to get another Starliner. We're going to get another Ampler Dude. And it's going to be sick. But we are getting close to the end. I'm going to just open an All-Stars Cup here real quick. And it's still painted, staying within the theory, uh, with the theme, because we had an extra 12,500 to play with. Titanium white blade on inverted. Nice. Pink blade on inverted. <gasps> nice. Sky blue proffer. Not so much, not so nice, but uh, we move on. Blade ons. It's mental how fast you can blast through these. Okay, to change up the luck, I'm going to do a hydration cup. Remember to drink your water. Whatever beverage you have with you, drink with me. Cheers. Okay, a crimson import. Not bad. Now we're going to do a no reaction trade up to get this exotic we need. Well, I was hoping we'd get an exotic and then level up to a black market like this. But it's another very rare. This might be... Bro, I I'm not going to lie. That's not the greatest 1.5 million opening I've ever seen. I will say that. It's scenes and it's always going to be decent because there's 1.5 million credits. So we got a painted Starline, a painted Ampler dude. But two black markets in 1.5 million tournament credits isn't great. However, we do have trade-ups and we do have license. We can trade up literally any of these. So we might as well go for it and uh, see what we can get. And then we're going to keep the non-painted Sunsetter is an example. Very good. And we're also keeping Blade on inverted. So don't go anywhere. You might have thought that the Chromatic Cups were a little bit washed. And uh, I'd be inclined to somewhat agree with you. Um, however, this could still be good. I probably... Okay, no. I was going to say I probably should have kept the Titanium White Blade Ons. But they are there. Uh, there's a duplicate, but they're different certifications. I'll keep the proffer. I'll uh, trade up the Guardian one. There we go. Bang. Breakout time. So we got the two wheels for very rare in titanium white and we do keep those. And now we need to make sure we don't trade up the Sunsetter non-duplicates. And uh, I've got to, got to be very careful the way I do this. So here we go. We're going to go with you two, one of you, and you for number one. Proffer Hatch regular. Okay. You, 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 and you can all go. Not bad. We got the non-painted one. That's good. Crimson Sunsetter, you can go. And there we go. Even though it is purple, these are both purple. That's certified. So I consider that to be different, I guess. So we'll keep that. You can go. You can go. You can go. And none of these can go. So there we go. Moving on now to the best of the bunch. Proffer Hatch, you can both go. Blade on inverted. I only have one non-painted, so I've got to keep that. Uh, so it's pretty much just proper hatch and any duplicates. We've got a duplicate there, a duplicate there. I don't think there's any more duplicates of the blade on inverted. So we're going to move on to the proper hatch. Here we go. Can we get something sick? We already got that, didn't we? 
we 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 got that <laughs> we already got that that's absolutely mental but hey we move on uh we're gonna trade up the proper hatch make sure i get the right wheels bang come on yes Okay, you know, I'll take it. I'll take non-painted. We needed that. We needed that for sure. Okay, now I'm going to go with you. I'm going to go with... I kind of want to keep that, though. I kind of want to keep that. So we are going to do this. It's going to be a Dunker or a Wacky Taffy. These aren't in the archives, so I think they're fair game. And even though I know he's not crazy about the proper hatch wheels, we can keep a titanium white one, and we can keep all the blade on inverted as per their request. Come on! Wacky Taffy. All right, well, Wacky Taffy. I mean, hey, I said we get another Starliner. I said we get another Ampler Dude, and we did indeed. Uh, they didn't mention anything about the blueprints, but there's not really much you can do with them. So I am going to try and see if we can get something sick. If we go to series here and keep it in the select favorites too as much as possible. So this is either a Shade Raid, Dueling Dragons, Interstellar, or Stipplegate. Come on. Oh, regular Interstellar. Dorado, Encryption Carbonator. Wait. Dorado, Phoenix kind of stride tide. Okay, we'll go with these. We'll go with these. Um, bang! Carbonator regular from the Alriga series. And there's nothing that we can trade up there. So we are finished. 1.5 million tournament credits. It comes as no surprise to you that for this video, I do, of course, have to give all the credit to Arpiglart and for grinding the tournaments to get to 1.5 million tournament credits. One of them, or maybe two of them, were actually with me as well. And it was a really good time. So if you did enjoy this video, please do drop a like. Subscribe down below to join the Pixel Army. Check out Arpiglart on Twitch. And make sure you turn on the bell down below so you don't miss any new videos because the new season is coming up very, very soon. But regardless, that is going to do it from me. I've been Pixel. You have been awesome. And I'll see you in the next video very soon. Now that I think about it, Titanium White Sunsetter, Black Sunsetter, that's sick as well, by the way.